Well, we found the spirit of the Spartans. Hey, Poochie. Hey, you, 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 you. Yes, us guys. As we continue the Greek road trip. Now behind me here, it may look like an ordinary field near the highway. But what we are about to walk across is possibly the most famous battlefield on earth. And probably the most famous from antiquity. The Thermopylae Pass, or Hades Gate. We are walking across the very field where Leonidas and his 300 Spartans, along with his 700 Thespian allies, fought to the very last man in one of antiquity's and history's itself greatest last stand. Now you might say technically the actual battlefield is about 20 feet below our feet because over time the coast moved back from where this road is about a kilometer or two in that direction. But that takes away nothing from how excited I am. I know some might just think this is a field but this is literally the story that, that everyone knows. For three days and nights, the Spartans and their 7,000 Greek allies held back a force of over 300,000 Persians. Well, estimates go from anywhere from 120,000 to 300,000, but the ancient stories say over a million. But for three days and nights, they were able to hold them back through this narrow passageway from reaching mainland Greece. On the third day, a local trader showed the Persians the way through these mountains. I'm not exactly sure where the actual pass is, but then the Persians were able to outflank the Greek army and kill everyone. Leonidas was actually aware of this, and he dismissed the bulk of the force. Only his 300 personal guard of Spartan warriors and his 700 thespian allies remain behind. Where they fought the last man. On the ground that we are walking. Later on, there were other battles fought here of great historical significance as well. They are somewhat forgotten in comparison. Now besides, the story that we all know of Leonidas and his Spartans in 480 BC. In 191 BC, the Romans also fought a major battle against the Seleucids here, where the Seleucids, 13,000 of their men and their war elephants, were defeated by the Roman legions. So, Thermopylae, historical wise and site of battlefield wise, is definitely one of the most significant on earth and to be able to walk across it like so many great men have throughout history <laughs> it's it's quite a feeling ahoo ahoo <laughs> You just get a bottle with your soul. <laughs> well, I believe what's left here is part of the Phocian Wall. The Persians were coming from this direction. And Leonidas and his 300 Spartans made their last stand somewhere around that hill. At least that's what is thought. That's the accepted theory. So what we just walked across was where they were, you can picture them lined up in a phalanx against an onslaught of Persian arrows and troops, Persian immortals. You know what, I, I can't put exactly in words how that must have felt, but combat is a special thing. It's just crazy to be able to touch this place. Now, 
<laughs> I almost forgot to do that. <laughs> so on or around this hill here is where Leonidas made his final stand. And him and his men were buried on or around this hill. It's crazy to think the amount of history, you know, behind a, a mound of rocks and dirt. It's kind of crazy. People still leave flowers. I mean, that just shows you how much the spot is revered. Now, it looks like they are doing excavations over here. This is probably where they were buried. Crazy. So throughout time, many monuments have been built on this hill. But the inscription has always stayed the same. Roughly translated to, O oh stranger, tell the Spartans that here we lie obedient to their laws. More or less saying, here we did our duty and fought to the death. No, we didn't. That's funny. It's obviously an illusion, but as we were standing here watching the sunset, it looked like it came back up over the hill. Well, it makes this moment even more significant. I mean, it's the clouds that cause the illusion, but... Could also be the ghost of Leonidas! <sighs> I don't think he was in charge of sun. Oh, we found the spirit of the Spartans. Hey, Poochie. Hey, you, 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 you. It's a good cover. We'll go find you some snacks. Yeah, we'll find something for him. So here's the phrase that every gun nerd in the States puts on their truck. Molan Abe and Leonidas. Yeah, drop that for him. Yeah, he is thirsty. Yeah, this one is scary. Yeah, he's probably born wild. Or maybe he's abused. Hello Xerxes. Xerxes, Leonidas, and uh, uh Fati. <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> hey, Xerxes is less scared of you. Guys, thanks so much for joining me on that really special occasion. I mean, <laughs> a great moment. And I'm glad I could share it with you. I appreciate you, as always. Thank you for your time. You didn't have to give it to me. We'll see you on the next one. <laughs>